Hi, welcome to Kiana Creates. I'm Kenyatta. Welcome to my channel. Today is Whip Wednesday, and I did start a new whip. I didn't want to, but I had to get this whip started because I'm making something for Trisha's Creator Treasures. Hashtag Halloween Make, -a make Along MAL 2023. I mean, 22. Jesus. <laughs> I'm in a rush. <laughs> oh, this year. But. It's hashtag Halloween MAL 2022. And this is the book I ordered for Amazon. And I will leave a link down in the description box to make something out of this. And I am making this Halloween Mr. Pumpkinhead. And so far, I've made my very first pumpkin. I've never made a pumpkin before today, so this is my very first pumpkin. I've made his stem. And I made one of his boots and legs. And it's a little off because the colors she said to grab are not the colors he's wearing. Because, like, his boots are blue in this picture, but she says in the pattern to use gray yarn. So I use gray yarn and for the sweater, his sweater looks yellow, but in the um, pattern, she said use golden yarn. So I got golden yarn set aside for that. And so, so that is the only thing that's a little off, but I'm following what the pattern says, the colors. So far I've used, I love this yarn in the color key line and this is for the stem and it's also going to be for the scarf i have used this color burnett super value in the color uh carrot and this is the pumpkin I also use Red Heart Super Saver in the color Dusty Gray for the boots. And for the leg, I've used Red Heart Super Saver in the color Death Blue. So, these are my little pieces that I have so far. I'm taking a break now because this pattern is it's easy to read but I didn't follow the directions like <laughs> I'm used to patterns that tell me like step by step like if this is supposed to be back loop only tell me in that line in that sequence well in that um in that row this is back loop only she has continuing back loop only so I'm thinking just that first line back loop only then I'm going to single crochet no, because later on, she says, now continuing both loops. I'm like, oh, but I'm not taking it out. So this isn't done right, but it looks like a boot. So I'm keeping it. I wasn't about to frog it out. So I'm going to have to mess up on the second boot because it's made. Whether it's done right or not, it is what it is. I was a little confused, but... She did say continuing back loop only. I just did my own thing because I was like, no, this means this. and But it didn't mean that. So it's my fault. It's not the patterns. It's my fault. But this is a really cool book. Um, I really, really wanted to make the Frankenstein, but I don't have any DK yarn to make it because these patterns are required are asking for DK yarn. And the only reason, well, I'm not doing this in DK yarn. I'm doing this in worse away. But the only reason that I'm not doing it in DK because it doesn't um, require clothing. And at the back of the book, I'm going to try to show you. It has templates for the clothing. And it's not going to fit if I make it in worse away yarn. So Frankenstein this is the Frankenstein template for his shirt 
So I'm going to have to buy some DK yarn if I want to do the Frankenstein. But this is the template for the pumpkin face. So I could cut out in black felt. So that's cool that they have that back there. I'm definitely going to use that. Um, so yes, I really enjoyed this book. Like I said, I will leave a link down in the description box because I did get this from Amazon. And it's a really cool book multimedia so you would need extra things on um, this one only the only extra thing i would need is felt and i already got black felt because i had made a um a coca melon tv and i had some black felt left over so i didn't have to buy anything for this pattern i just used the worst rate that i had and the felt that i have so it's pretty cool but some people have fabric laid around. Some people buy DK weight. So this book could be great if you have already DK weight in your stars, in your stash. Stash. But thank you for joining me today. Let me know what you're making down in the comment section. Can I talk today? Can I? I'm having a hard time. I'm all mixed up. <sighs> Lord help me. But let me know what you're working on down in the comment section. I really enjoy hearing it. It makes my day when I get comments. Um, every little joy that I get these days is helpful because I've been going through depression. So it makes me really happy when I see your comments. So I do appreciate all of you who do comment. It makes my day. Thank you so much. So give this video a like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to click the notification bell to be notified whenever I post another video. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.